This program contains some material that many parents would not find suitable for children under the age of 14. Viewer discretion is advised. What's going on everybody and today I have for you guys a special treat. No, it's not the Funko Casino, but it is Wrestling Figure Casino. So as you guys can see, I have four mystery boxes right here. I actually purchased these directly off of a Whatnot live stream from Mr. Brightside Toys. Um, he started them out and obviously they went as high as however they went. I spent on the four boxes collectively, I spent $165 on all four boxes. So if you really want to get technical and break it down real fast, so $165 divided by four. So I basically spent $41.25 a box. So now what we're going to do is we're going to see what we got in the box and we're gonna see if I got my value back. I'm hoping that I got my value back. Otherwise, well, you guys know how it is, especially with the Funko Casino and what you've seen in the past, the house always wins. I'm hoping for the house not to win today. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna open them up individually. I'm gonna show them to you guys. And then what we're gonna do is that we'll check it across uh, eBay, see what the going average is for those. And we'll go from there. So let's go ahead, let's get these opened and let's see what we got so we got there was a hundred boxes i got box 55 90 42 and 73 i picked like just real random odd numbers um you know because i figured all right if i pick an odd number maybe there's a chance of a good figure being in there so let's see what we got from the first figure all right so here we go i can see it's a wwe elite all right, so I can already tell I'm gonna lose on this one. <laughs> and it begins. See, I just dropped it on the floor because I don't care. So we got uh, top picks, must have superstars. We got Elite Collection, Drew McIntyre. So here we go. So now it begins. So I'm assuming this is probably like a $20, $25 figure tops. So we've already lost half our money on that on that one. But here it is right here, Drew McIntyre, top picks. And of course it's certified authentic. So whatever that means for WWE fans, but portrait doesn't look too bad. So there's one right there. Let's open up box number 90. See what we got here. All right, box number 90. We got Series 78 Elite Kofi Kingston. So, comes with, what is that, the pancakes? It's, yeah, it's the plate of pancakes. And we got one of the World Tag Team Championship belts. And I believe this is their uh, unicorn gear. So we got... Kofi Kingston. I don't have a Kofi Kingston, so that's actually kind of cool. So I'll, I'll take that. And that was Elite 78 Kofi Kingston. Um, box 42. Let's see what we picked. Again, guys, I just picked random numbers because, you know, hoping, hoping to get some good stuff. Figured maybe the odder the number, the better the chances of getting a, uh, getting a figure that might be rare but who knows all right so here's another one this is the legends uh series 10 john cena so i already know i lost my ass on this one comes with the uh, devil looking vince mcmahon puppet this was the wave that actually had diamond dallas page john cena brutus of barber beefcake and big van vader in it so all right and obviously you gotta hold out hope for box number 73. Hopefully something good is in there. That'll at least maybe offset some of the money I've lost because I can tell already by all these I've 
lost. There's, there's no, there's, listen, if there's some chance that that Kofi is worth like a hundred bucks, then we might be in business. But other than that, I doubt that highly. Oh, okay. Okay. We got Ultimate Edition, um, John Cena, the uh, Hustle, Loyalty, Respect. So this is, I don't know if this, I can't remember. God, there's so many. This is what I don't like about the Ultimate Edition figures. They should only put out one of each character. They should never re-release. So what they did is that they've put out another John Cena that was with The Rock, and they had a John Cena that came out with Becky Lynch in that series. So I don't know which Cena this is. I think this is the one that came out with Becky Lynch. I'm not 100% sure, but we'll find out, obviously, when we research it. And this is great because I do love the Ultimate Edition figures. Those are kind of really the only ones I buy unless they're characters I like. But Ultimate Edition John Cena. So this is, th th this might be a score. All right, so what we're going to do now, I'm going to tally them. I'm going to go on. I'm going to pull up my phone right now. We're going to go on. We're going to see what we got. And uh, hopefully I win. All right, guys, so I have eBay up on my phone. Let's go ahead and scan Mr. Cena and see what he's going for. All right, give it the old Skanarooski. All right, let's see what the last ones he sold for. All right, so we've got the last one sold yesterday, and it was $13.99. There was one that sold on the 19th that was $17.79. Then there was another one that sold on March 18th for $8.50. Um... Wow, there was one that sold on March 11th for $4.25. Ouch. So I'm going to go ahead and just kind of on an average, I'm going to say it's it's like 15 bucks. So we already, we're already down, we're already down money. So $15 for John Cena. Um, let's see what we got going on for good old Kofi. All right. Uh, this never, this never, I, I never do well with these. I never do well with these. All right. So Kofi sold, the last Kofi sold on the 17th, which you guys can see right there. So there you go. So the last Kofi sold on the 17th for $23.99. Um, on the 15th for $29.99. 30 $29.99, $24, $30. All right, so we'll say it's like an average of 25 bucks. So still lost on Kofi. So we're at 15 and 25 right now. Then we got Top Picks Drew McIntyre, which I do absolutely not have any, any hopes for. All right, let's see what the last ones sold were. So the last one sold yesterday for $15.99. We had one that sold the 31st for $20. We had one that sold on the 27th for dollars $50. $20, $9.99, $19.95, $14.95, $3.25, $7, $3.25. All right. So we're gonna call this, we're we're gonna call this one probably another $15, a $15 one. Just give or take. So we're at we're at uh, 25, 15, and 15. And then now, obviously, let's see what John Cena's worth. We'll see what John Cena this is. All right, this is Series 5. So this is the one that came with Becky Lynch. So I was I was spot on at least about, about that. Uh, let's see... All right, so we've got the last one sold February 27th for $48. Then we got another one for 54, one for 25, one for 85, one for 31, one for 25, one for 43, for 40. All right, so it looks like this is around like a $35, $40 figure. So Let's just do the let's just do the math. So we've got 15 plus 15 
plus 25 plus 40. 95 dollars okay 95 dollars and i spent a total of 165 dollars minus 95 so i lost 70 dollars there you go so again like i said the house always wins and i should have learned i should learn my lesson from all these years that i should never i should just stop doing mystery boxes because i always lose my ass all right, guys, and that's going to wrap up another episode of, I guess, if you want to call it, Wrestling Figure Casino. Um, I'll have to come up with a different name, and obviously when I can catch Wrestling Figure Mystery Boxes, I'll continue to do these. Even though I just said I should stop, of course I'm going to continue to do them because they're fun, they entertain you guys, and, uh, you know, hopefully one day I might just hit that, that one big one that just puts me to the moon. <laughs> so... All right, guys, and uh, yeah, so if you like what you saw, please be sure to give a thumbs up. If you're new, please be sure to subscribe. As always, be sure to hit that bell so you get notified every time another episode gets uploaded for your viewing pleasure. As always, you can check out all the excellent content we always offer right here at MCE. And until next time, guys, that's what's popping.